back at y'all with some more boxing news and updates. You already know this your boy Love One to Hate One. Let's go ahead and talk about this real quick. All right, man, look. Canelo has the opportunity to do something very big in only two fights. All right? Now, we know William Skull, he's food for Canelo. He just robbed Vladimir Shishkin. We all know Vladimir whooped that ass. But that's not Canelo's fault, right? Canelo can fight William Skull in about January. Shit, maybe you could squeeze that fight in for December, right? And then you could fight Arthur Betterbeef for a mega fight on Cinco de Mayo weekend, right? And let's go a step further. If Canelo really wants to, he can settle his differences with Dimitri Bivol in September of 2025 for Mexican Independence Day weekend, right? Look, you guys, Canelo has the opportunity to do something wild, man. Like, nobody has Canelo beating better beef. Well, from the people I've been talking to. Yes, a couple of people see him, like myself. But for the most part, people don't even see Canelo fighting better beef, let alone beating him, right? But I'm letting you guys know right now, I want to see this shit, man. Let's make it happen. William Skull in January or December, and then you got Arthur Betterby right around the corner. You don't need to fight Pitfall Benavidez like everybody is trying to say. Shit, he's not even a goddamn champion right now, right? But we'll get to Pitfall some other time. Canelo has bigger fish to fry, as you guys can see here. You beat William Skull. Now you're a two-time undisputed champion at 168. And then you go up and you whip Arthur Betterbeef's ass at 175. And then you get get back over Bivol on Mexican Independence Day weekend in September. Man, that'll be epic. That's my thoughts on this shit. I am out.